Add to Sketchbook and View Sketchbook are two very important tools and probably the most used in EQ8. Please be sure to watch the Project Sketchbook video to get a full understanding of what the sketchbook is and how it works. If you're working in an untitled project, that means the file has not been saved to your computer's hard drive yet. When you click the Add to Sketchbook button in an untitled project, you'll be prompted to save the project file. By default, all projects are saved in Documents, My EQ8, Projects. You can change this directory if you'd like, but we highly recommend keeping all your EQ8 projects in one place. Name your project here and click Save. The file has now been created on your hard drive. The Add to Sketchbook button will save any in-progress work that's currently on the work table you are viewing. So, if you're designing a quilt and you have a base layer of your quilt top finished, click Add to Sketchbook to keep that version of your design. You are adding this version of the quilt to your project in the sketchbook. Or maybe you're drawing a complicated foundation piece block. Click Add to Sketchbook often during your design process. Each time you click Add to Sketchbook, the current version of your design gets saved to your project sketchbook, but it doesn't overwrite your previous design. It adds a new variation of your design into the sketchbook. Let's take a look. To view the contents of your project sketchbook, click on this button here, or choose View Sketchbook from the menu. Right now I'm viewing the quilt section and I can see here that I have multiple variations of my design. Again, each time I clicked Add to Sketchbook, a new variation was created. If I wanted to go back to a previous version of my design, I can select the variation and click Edit to start working on this variation. I'll click the View Sketchbook button again to view the blocks in this project. Here are my in-progress drawings. I'll select the variation I want to start with, then click Edit to start working. The best part about the sketchbook is that you can truly keep your project organized. You can delete any unwanted variations of quilts or blocks. You can delete fabrics or sort them to put your favorite colors in front. There are a lot of features within the sketchbook. Again, please be sure to watch the project sketchbook video to learn more.